good afternoon guys and happy um thursday happy new year's new year's eve <laughs> happy christmas eve to all your sunshiny faces um look at that dog back there they're in their christmas sweaters actually there was snow on the ground for christmas eve that was pretty amazing and it's not supposed to get any warmer so you might actually have snow on the ground for Christmas. And on top of that too, it is still actually snowing. But it is so light. Like, I mean, it is just itty bitty little flurries. It, no more really has accumulated. But like all of a sudden, like it get like, he not heavy again, it was flurries. But there'd like be a lot and then they'd like let up again and maybe stop. But like right now, even still, it's like just very tiny little light, um, you know, little dusting of snow. But it's like... Um, at about 10 11 o'clock today it was 13 degrees outside so that's why everything that like happened last night with our almost it wasn't a thunderstorm like a rainstorm pretty much you know all of that ended up I guess turning into snow pretty much and now again it is some of it did end up sort of sticking but it's just like I said that real light like flurry sort of so um yeah that is what is going on we're actually um we're gonna wait I think we're gonna eat dinner at like six o'clock um but me and my dad ran out like I said did that last minute Christmas shopping which um we always try and avoid <laughs> but um I guess like I said my parents ended up calculating wrong and one person didn't get as many gifts so we had to go run to one place um and go get some stuff um and so, um, yeah, that's where we ended up running out to this morning. And my dad also needed more um, wrapping paper. So we also ran to Menards and got Starbucks this morning too. So, um, yeah, that. And then Jack and my dad ended up picking up um, the dinner from Caputo's, um, which it was like a whole pre-made, hot, ready um, meal. I think it serves between 10 and 12 people or something like that. And it's just going to be us and Matthew's girlfriend as well for dinner. So it's six of us. Um, and so, um, you know, like I said, we should have most likely leftovers for tomorrow too, but we do have some things that we'll probably wind up doing for, um, for like sort of dinner appetizers throughout the day tomorrow. Um, cause that's normally how we do Christmas. It's just like, I think we have meatballs and then also ravioli too is what we're going to wind up doing for tomorrow. But, uh, we, they went and picked up the food, I think at three o'clock, like that was around one of the last times, I think four o'clock maybe was the last like time you could pick it up or five or something like that. Matthew is actually out with his girlfriend to go see I think maybe just her grandma or her grandparents um and then her parents as well and um they're gonna do like a Christmas Eve thing and then they're coming back over here and we're gonna eat around six o'clock I think that's maybe around the time they're supposed to be home um so my mom has got Christmas music jamming in the other room I actually have not eaten anything at all today so that is why I'm gonna have a real quick snack actually because again we're probably not eating for another two hours about but um there's not a whole ton that's going on not a whole ton to really update right now I am also happy that I did all my wrapping two days ago or whatever I don't have any presents I have to wrap I think my dad finished wrapping all of the gifts too so normally my parents will wind up staying up until they wouldn't wrap the presents until like Christmas Eve or maybe the day before Christmas Eve and it winds up taking them where they stay up until like three four in the morning wrapping gifts on Christmas Eve and so finally the two of them are actually gonna be able to go to bed early um, on Christmas Eve so we'll probably wind up getting up early you know I've never realized it but that was probably the actual reason why my parents were always so tired on Christmas Day in the morning we always had to wait to do Christmas was because they ended up staying up so late waiting to like wrap all the presents presents until Christmas Eve and then like I said they wind up having like a ton of gifts that they have to wrap um all in one night and so um my dad spaced it out where he's been like wrapping presents like for the last week or so so anyways I will update you guys though maybe later like we normally wind up opening one gift on Christmas Eve um so maybe I'll show you guys some of that too and then also to dinner when it is ready but um yeah I think it should stay for the most part warm if not we can always just throw it in the oven real quick um because again we've got like about an hour and a half or so um, until we're gonna have dinner. Wow, Put your jelly dog. Dog. Hi, Jetty Dog! He wants to play, but Charlie's just being all regular and just There's walking around. Dog. Look! He's like, I don't want to play right now. Can I get by? I'm to my tail higher than yours. It's like a little monkey. 
I can see Charlie's reflection in the oven. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's completely frozen. His tail's slowly dropping down. <laughs> Well guys, we took some prick, prick, we took some Christmas pictures <laughs> that I have for you guys um, of all of us in our Christmas pajamas. I'm still in my bottoms, but I am not. I changed my shirt. Um, and I cannot sleep in these because I get too hot in the middle of the night. I have to sleep in shorts. <laughs> so um, yeah, and then uh, all the puppies too, they all have got their... Bless, you got your Christmas sweater on? Your Christmas pajamas? Huh? Did you get your Christmas pajamas on? Oh, we all have matching Christmas pajamas? So I think we're going to take like pictures with the dogs maybe tomorrow. Because um, we realized that we forgot to do that. But um, yeah guys, it's late. We stayed up, we watched Christmas movies. Um, and well, it's not that late. It's late for me, because again, I was up at like seven o'clock or whatever. Um, but we ended up actually, I totally forgot to vlog earlier though. We ended up getting Caputo's, um, Caputo's like for dinner. Um, like Caputo's, they did like a catering thing. So it was a ham, which I think I was telling you guys too, it made, feeds like 10 to, 50 or 20, 10 to 12 people so um we have like leftovers for tomorrow too but it was a ham mashed potatoes corn um and then my mom ended up oh they also gave us cranberry sauce or cranberry relish and just bringing the christmas presents <laughs> um and my mom also ended up making um some cinnamon apples and then soup for like me and matthew's girlfriend too if she'd wanted some um that was like a vegetarian as well and so again we have got stuff left over for tomorrow and all of that but um yeah it's late i need to still take a shower and get to bed so i will see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog for christmas um if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love it if you'd subscribe and i'll see all your sunshiny pieces tomorrow so bye guys